More breaking news that we're following right now as new video has been released from the site of the Frazier sinkhole, sparking new concerns for the residents safety in that area. For that, we go live to Steve Garagiola at the Macomb County Office of Public Works in Clinton Township with the very latest information. Steve, good afternoon. Hey Rhonda, uh, the meeting is still going on inside, but here's what I can share with you. I guess this is kind of a good news, bad news story. The bad news for residents in the area who maybe were hoping or thinking this project is about done, completed, back to normal, that is not the case at all. There is still some good measure of months to finish this project. The good news is that they are making good progress and they have come upon some solutions so they believe it won't happen again. Uh, take a look at that video that they are sharing now in the meeting. Uh, this is with some video inside the pipe to show just what they're dealing with. Some of the key points that uh, Candace Miller is making in the meeting, she is the Public Works Commissioner in this county. Uh, one, that there has been no discharge of sewage into the Clinton River through this process, and that is very important. She called that an ecological disaster, had they needed to do that, but they have not needed that. There's been a lot of rain, which has made it tough. They are dealing with a lot of silt issue, removing silt and trying to repair the pipe because of the heavy rain we've had this spring. There is severe cracking in the pipe, and that certainly is a problem. Now, the good news is, and that's what I touched upon their solutions, there is a new material they're talking about to use in replacing this pipe, some 3,700 feet of pipe, this 11-foot diameter, enormous pipe. Uh, it's a six to $7 million project. They did just take a vote to approve moving forward on that because in Candace Miller's words, we cannot do this again. The people living in this area and living in this county cannot go through this again. Uh, another sinkhole and more damage like this. So uh, I don't have more details than that again because the meeting is going on right now. We're going to head back inside as they finish things up. We'll have all the details at five. But bottom line is uh, they are making progress. They are moving forward. They have voted to move forward with this new material and that will work toward a solution. Uh, reporting live in Clinton Township, I'm Steve Garagiola, Local 4.